the COVID pandemic has been devastating to the whole medical ecosystem. Rates of depression have skyrocketed. Suicide rates have increased. Rates of impulse control disorders have exacerbated because people are at home. Binge eating disorders are skyrocketing. Alcohol use disorder and substance use disorder is skyrocketing. And for patients with say schizophrenia or Parkinson's, this impulsivity disorders are skyrocketing. So we do need drugs to treat that. The time is absolutely right for Bright Minds Biosciences unique portfolio of medications. After a career in academics and clinical practice, I have been working in pharmaceutical industry for the past 18 years, working mainly on novel drugs, bringing hope of new therapies to patients with significant unmet clinical needs. My journey through the last couple of decades has brought me to Bright Minds Biosciences, where we stand on the cusp of an exciting new revolution in the management of neurologic disease, in pain, and in neuropsychiatric illnesses. Bright Minds is basically a natural products based company because uh, we've taken inspiration from Mother Nature to redesign uh, compounds like psilocybin present in magic mushrooms. Which, you know, structurally, I mean, the chemistry is, is very simple. It's a simple molecule, but what it looks like is it looks like serotonin, which is one of the most abundant of the neurotransmitters present in the human brain. Psilocybin is a great compound. It's the first generation of its class. It has uh, shown us the way, shown us a glimpse of the path we have to go forward to develop actual drugs to treat patients. Bright Minds Biosciences is in a unique position because we have solid intellectual property. We're the only company in the psychedelic space that has a granted patents on serotonergic selective agents. And this, you know, really differentiates us from all the other psychedelic companies. There have been a lot of advances in neuroscience and neuropsychiatry, especially in the field of serotonin biology. However, Big Pharma has not really capitalized on this. Most of the research dollars today are spent on oncology and rare genetic diseases, and now most recently on uh, COVID vaccines and antivirals. But we cannot wait for another crisis to start spending uh, research dollars on neuropsychiatry. That is why Bright Minds has decided to advance its portfolio of unique compounds today, now in 2020.